Solidarity forever, solidarity forever, solidarity forever. The union makes us strong. Bogus power, bogus power, bogus power. So the 17,000 shillings is not even uh, something that you can give to a casual worker. So kindly we are just pleading. We are pleading with the government and we are demanding for our rights. It is not that we don't care for that child, but it is just because that we are being subjected to oppression. And therefore we are demanding that we be employed and we are not going to relent. We are not going back to school before we, uh, we get employed. Courts made their pronouncement and uh, what we only expect is that anybody, any government agent, any parastatal must be ad must adhere to court orders. We don't ex there's nobody above the law. And the court made this pronouncement. It's not the business of court to watch around what you are doing and where you are. The moment they declare that we don't have an employment call in turn, they have finished. It's up to the Government and Teacher Service Commission to revise employment terms of these teachers so that they are rightfully employed. Yes. As at now, yes. as at now, we don't have any teachers called in turns. Yes. Hey, according to the law, according to declaration by the court, it's illegal to employ people in the teaching profession with such a terminology. And they are not ready to do that. Teachers, are you ready? No! We are the teachers. We cannot accept to be oppressed in our own nation. Yes. We cannot accept to suffer in our own country. Yes. We are calling upon the, uh, the government and the president of this country, President William Samoya Ruto, to come out clearly and tell us Basing on his agendas when he was campaigning, in that we are suffering under his watch. Yes. And that one, as teachers of this country, we will not accept. The court pronounced itself very clearly on this particular issue, and we don't know why it is being taken into circles. Yes. We are demanding, in very uncertain terms, that by July this year, those who are still in terms should have been confirmed on permanent and pensionable terms. Mogul's power. power! The issue about January 2025 does, does not feature in our union. And we want to say that uh, if doctors, with the few numbers that they had, were able to be given a hearing by the government, mm. teachers, 
we don't recognize the issue of internship in teaching. Once a teacher has been employed, that teacher is supposed to be employed on permanent and pensionable terms. We don't agree with the issue of internship in teaching and therefore, Punda Mechoka, our colleagues of Mechoka, and what they're going through is tough. They're going through tough moments and we are demanding that they should be confirmed with the immediate effect. It should never go beyond 1st of July this year. Mogul's power. Power. And they should even be compensated.